Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Bowman Baseball Sapphire Edition. This is pick your team number 19. And coming up right after this in a separate video will be pick your team 20. We've got a couple coming up back to back. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into the action. There's also that break credit promo too. So if you bought at least two teams, you'll get one entry. Four teams gets you two entries, so on and so forth in that pattern. And uh, we'll randomize those entries, and the top two names will get 50 bucks of break credit each. Uh, Padres and Indians. Uh, we were talking about talking about pitchers who have won Cy Youngs in both leagues. Pretty interesting question. If you're rewatching this break, look it up. All right, Stephen Punk, do you have trivia for us? When Wayne Gretzky got traded from L.A. to the St. Louis Blues. Did they make the playoffs, and how far did they get? I don't remember him going to the St. Louis Blues. I know he ended up on the Rangers, maybe, late in his career, and I think maybe had a decent season. TJ says finals. Um, Cy Young and Rookie of the Year. Has that has that happened? Maybe if, I think maybe did Fernando do it? Oh, nice Luis Robert Orange to seventy five. That'll be for the White Sox. Aaron Haynes, nice. Dwight Gooden, maybe, Rookie of the Year, and... Ooh, and a Dominguez. Wow. So a Luis Robert Orange of 75 followed up right by right next to a Jason Dominguez. That's for Matthew Shira. Nice. An all-card chip in this Sapphire, ladies and gentlemen. So just in the interest of time... Can't do all of these, but but they will all be sleeved and top loaded. That's how valuable this stuff can be. There's Adam Kloffenstein for the Bluebirds. Adam Kupperman with the Blue Jays. By the way, I don't have answers for that Cy Young Rookie of the Year, so if you're waiting for me to say it, I don't know. Someone's got to look it up. <laughs> Now, if if you're if you're lucky enough to get some of these uh, these cards in this group break from jazbeescasebreaks.com, um, make sure you uh, at least look up the values, even for players that you think that don't have the big names like Luis Robert and Bobby Wood and Jason Dominguez. It's worth looking up because you might be surprised at how well they do. Or if you know your baseball and you think, oh, this I feel like this prospect could be a lot bigger later on down the line, then yeah, maybe get it graded, hold on to it. Wait, what? Is that true, 116? The 116 sports card is the same. If, fact, if Gretzky never scored a goal in his entire career, he would still be the all-time points leader in the NHL? I guess I don't know how points work. <laughs> what do you get? How do you, how do you get points outside of goals? Assists? Assists gets you points. What else? All right, there's Bobby Wood Jr., Royals, Ben, with that one. Wow. It's just goals and assists, and he has more assists. Gretzky has more assists than anyone has total points? Career points? That is wild. Dang. 
how close is the next person? Like that who's act I guess who's active. Or maybe both. Both retired and active. How close is anybody? There's a uh, Luis Patino for the Padres. That'll be for Rich. And Spencer Howard to 75. Yager says Brad. Yeah, Jaeger, Yager? How close? Well, I mean, how many points behind are they? I guess it wouldn't be as impressive as if it's only by one point. I mean, it's still pretty impressive. It didn't score any goals. Phillies, John Samuelson. And the next closest active player is Joe Thornton. It's crazy. Gretzky, 2,857. Younger has. 1921 and Thornton has 1509. That is, I think, the greatness of the great one. I think uh, may be underrated. Jay says he also has a thousand points for a hot wife. Yeah, she's easy on the eyes. Their kids, I think, are are rambunctious, from what I understand. Aren't aren't their children always getting in trouble? I don't know who his kids are, but. I think like Vin Scully's grandkids are apparently are a bit of a. Craziness. All right. There is Xavier Edwards. 15 out of 15. Uh, that was yesterday, Justin Larson. That was a pretty amazing hit. All right. Nice. Nice red parallel for Rich Schmidt and the Padres. And another Jason Dominguez for Matthew Shira. Tannen saying... Oh, Flip saying Angel's going to win it all. Tannen saying hope so. Pitching needs to improve, though. Matthew Shearer with the Yankees. I'd like to see how... Uh, I'd like to see how uh, Joe Adele does if he gets playing time. If I'm the Angels, <laughs> I'd be like, Trout, sit it out. It's okay. And just have, uh, just have Joe Adele play every day. That'll be hashtag good for the hobby. All right, and there's Adam Kloffenstein. I think we might we might need to do one more, Jada. We need to do five, 105 and 106. All right, Blue Jays, that'll, Adam Kupperman with the Bluebirds. Yeah, that's our second one. I don't think I've seen any. I guess they were all hiding here. At Stephen Punk says, that, don't forget the Cubs are going to win it all? I don't know. The Cubs don't have the pitching. The Reds, on the other hand, DJ saying Reds over Yankees in four. We always sweet. Reds have the pitching staff and, and, and some good hitters. They could be pretty dangerous to put it all together. Are you serious? The Reds have not lost a World Series game since Fisk hit the walk-off in 1975? How many has that been since 70? They won one in early 90s. That that was the Jose Rio Barry Larkin team, maybe? Chris Sabo, perhaps? 
on that red team. Another Dominguez. That's for Matthew Shira. Yeah, it's, that's, that's the only reason why I can't forget Chris Sabo. Nice one, Matthew Shear. Another Jason Dominguez. Those are still hot. Yeah, as a uh, as a kid who grow, grew up wearing uh, eyeglasses, I'd look at Chris Sabo and be like, yeah, that's cool. You can still have stuff on your eyes and play the game. Colin Barber. Astros. That's going to go to Adam Kupperman with Astros. All right, next one. Oh, Paul O'Neill was a red bat? I don't remember that. <laughs> Stephen Punk says Cubs versus Tampa Bay. Rays in the World Series. EA thinks Braves. Braves could put it all together. James likes the Mets World Series. John Samson A's. Yeah, and I mean, in a 60-game season, a short season, where each division plays each other's division, interleague play too, I mean, is it? who knows what's going to happen? Who's going to opt in, opt out? Who's going to get sick? Who's going to stay healthy? You know? Got, we've got John Rave. Rave? Is that really his name? Or is it Rave? I don't, there's no accent on there. I don't know. And it goes to the Royals, Ben with the Royals, and a Robert Pot. They call him Robert. His name is Robert Pawson. 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 Oakland A's, Aaron Tooley with that. That's it, folks. Uh, oh, no, I got to give away money. I was about to just sign off. No. Come on, Joe. Don't be a dumb. All right. If you bought at least two teams, you get break credit. Entry for break credit. All right, so Adam, with four, that gets you two entries. John Samuelson with four, that gets you two entries. EA with two, that gets you an entry. Gary with two, that gets you an entry. Joe C with two, that gets you an entry. Mark B with two, that gets you an entry. Michael with two, that gets you an entry. And Steve with two, that gets you an entry. All right, so that's 10. Top two names will get $50 of break credit each. After six times. Let's randomize it six times. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six times, not this time, John Samuelson, Mark, and Adam, though, congrats to both of you. I think these might be the first time these two are winning. Break credit um, in here in Pick Your Team number 19. That's it, folks. 2020 Bowman Baseball Sapphire Edition in the books. Another one coming up. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.